WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of a very sunny and cool Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update. We've got a sea of green out there. All the sectors with inside the S&P 500 are trading to the upside, as are all the U.S. indices that we track. Dow's up 185 points. That's about a half a percent. Four tenths for the S&P. 20 points there. Three almost four tenths for the nasdaq 161 points 31 points for the russell one and six tenths of a percent move there the trannies are up 123 points semis up a quarter percent or 10 points out there gold's up 15 dollars three quarters percent silver's up one and a quarter percent 30 cents lights we crude up a buck 19 natural gas is off nine cents the 30-year treasury up 21 ticks he's printed out at 123.29 so what's all that mean steve-o let's go take a look at that nine panel market update chart we begin with the es mini upper left hand side what we know about it is trading above the 1.2 oh it's a targeting the 1.272 aid uh expansion of its last set of swing points don't worry folks i'll get this figured out here that's at the 4894 level now you want to stay tuned for the Trader's Edge show because we'll take a deeper dive into the ES Mini. Spot volatilities is down below its 50-day exponential moving average, but we have a slightly rising closing price of the spot volatilities. So that's something for us to keep an eye on. It's the NQ that's at the 1.272 expansion of its last set of swing points. That's at 16.975. Its next upward target will be 17.699. U.S. dollar index finding resistance at the bottom of that profile, but it does have support at 101.60. That's what we're we'll watching on any kind of move lower the gold and silver both are consolidating with inside their profiles gold between 2017 90 and the resistance levels up at 2062 90 for silver it's down at 2390 for support 2479 for resistance light speed crude should target the top of its daily profile this is the february contract that we're taking a look at that's up at 77.55 we take a look at natural gas. Natural gas should be at support, or it has support between two, well, the support area is between 224 and 229. Price right now trading out at 2.32. So it's right in its support zone. If we take a look at the 30 year treasury, yesterday was a small bearish engulfing candle, but it was a bearish engulfing candle, and that confirmed a sell the D point pattern. That being said, we also have a new profile that's attempting to form. Support here is at 122.15, and resistance is at 124. That says on any move lower with regard to that top, it's very likely to find support at the 122.15 level out there. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Edge show if you would, but if you have to start your Tuesday, have a terrific one. Thanks for joining us. We'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care and be safe out there.